Hey, hey, be there in a second. Just gotta uh, get my key. up. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, so, hi, we're here. Um, pretty uh, chaotic day. Had a lot going on. Um, welcome to the stream. We're we'll playing, uh, for the first time in like a month, uh, Newtopia on the TurboGrafx-16. Um, oh, I need to get my guide. which I had uh, not picked up. Um, hey, True. Uh, weird week, uh, for sure. I I woke up yesterday with a lot of back pain. I don't know what I did, but yesterday was, was pretty bad. And then today, it felt better. And I, um, I did my yoga uh, earlier. And I feel, like, way better now. So, I don't know. All right. Uh, Newtopia. So. Oh, um. What else do I need to say? Uh. I don't know. My glasses are all smeared. That's what it is. Oh, yeah, for sure. Uh, we streamed on Monday. I streamed, um, what did we play? Um, Double Dragon 3? And we bounced off Double Dragon 3 because, yo, as people said, Double Dragon 3 sucks so much. I, I, I can't even begin to describe how bad it is. Um, it, it, it is repulsive. Um, and then so we played, uh, some Blaster Master Zero. Uh, after that um, for a while and uh, I'm at the end of Blaster Master Zero now last night I got to the last area and I'm like I got the map and I'm like oh yeah yeah sometimes notifications are weird they like don't go out right um you know, if you don't get it after a couple minutes, you know, I would just check the stream itself. Um, that happens with, um, uh, a couple people I know. Um, that's been a, a, like, recently, that's been, like, a big Twitch issue. issue. But, yeah, I'm, like, halfway through Area 8 of Blossom Master Zero, so hopefully this weekend I can wrap that up. That game rules. It is so cool. I'm way into it. Uh, okay, so we were about to, I checked the video earlier, because I absolutely could not remember where we were. We were about to go in here. And I don't remember much about it. 
Um, yeah, cause it's been it's been a month uh, since we since we streamed this because we did two Dragon Quest streams, and then we had the Christmas Eve stream and the New Year's Eve stream that all um, got in the way. Wait, why is it dark? Did I not get? Be quiet down there. Come on, come on, stop, 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 stop. Did we not get the Moonbeam Moss? I could have sworn we did. Oh, okay, I get it. Okay, you have to have it equipped. Okay. I gotta move my teeth. It's banging on my knee. Yeah, 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 I know. Um, I found in my experience that when that stuff gets leaked, it's usually pretty valid. Because that's the thing these days. Um, that all has to get approved, like, all around the world. So, it, um, you know, it's probably legit. But yeah, that's uh, right in time for spring break. Uh, Hanamiya Mass Effect Trilogy. That is probably a bad idea. Just like um, uh, Breath of the Wild and Switch didn't come out spring break week, but it was like, spring break was like the week. There was like, it came out on a Friday and it was like a week and then there was spring break. And... Um, Man, I played... Oh, dude, I put like 30 hours into that game over spring break that week. It was crazy. Okay, we are like totally gonna die here. Yeah. Alright, whatever. That's why we have safe states. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it too, for sure. Um, I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty psyched on it, and it's it's supposed to be all from what I read. It's all like kind of redone too, so I'm 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 curious what that's gonna look like. Cause yeah, I mean there was definitely some glitchy stuff in that series. Um, for sure. And it was stuff that, you know, could use some graphical cleanup. Especially in the first, uh, the first two. I feel like the third one was, like, real, like, uh, you know, was, like, way more improved in that regard. Uh, my playthrough of those games was whatever year, uh, Graphic Narratives was. I don't remember what year that was, but it was that, um, I played two in the summer and then three in the fall. Because, um, I was waiting on, and then Dragon Age Inquisition came out. 
Yeah, that was like the big Bioware, uh... Yeah, whatever year, uh, that, I don't remember. 14, maybe? I know it was a it was a while ago at this point. I was actually just, uh, reshelving, um the books from that class. I keep all my workbooks together by class. And um, so the, uh, the um, Watchmen and V for Vendetta and um, Fun Home and uh, what was the other one? Ghost World. Crap. It'd be great if this game had um, health potions. Like, more accessible health potions. I mean, it has, it has them, but... Yeah, Killing Joke, right, 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 right. Yeah, I was just thinking about Killing Joke because um, uh, Struggle Session just did an episode about uh, the Killing Joke. And the kind of, um, all the kind of weird cultural stuff around it. Oh, yeah, 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 I remember this now. Okay, yeah, so we got that. Okay, so where's that? All right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I think the, like, the kind of, like, um, whole thing where everyone got mad about the killing joke for a while, I think was a little overblown, probably. Um. For sure. I think there's some interesting things going on in there. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, Ghost Ghost World was the fifth one. And then the next semester when I was going to run it, um, I was going to do this uh, graphic novel this graphic novel called Incognito. I forget the author's name. Um, John something. And um, it's about a, de a, a black detective um, investigating a murder. And... Uh, one of my friends had, uh, my friend Nicole had told me, um, about it. Um, her Twitter handle, she has a private account, so I wouldn't say, you've seen me retweet, because you haven't. Um, uh, but she's an old friend of mine going back, oh gosh, 25 years probably. Alright. And she'd suggested it, and I was gonna teach it. But then the class got canceled, so. That was the end of that. Alright. There we go. I was gonna say, ooh, what are we, what are we doing here? All right, we went there. Okay. Yeah, I just looked real quick. I looked real quick at the last video at the end, and I'm like, okay, yeah, we were gonna go in the dungeon. All right. So this guy, there's a suit of armor in the, in the, in the room opposite here. I think we got that. Covering Batman Year One. Yeah, um, eventually, if that class had run again, I was probably going to do um, Year One. At some point, I would have. It was definitely, um, 
it's definitely on the list of stuff that I wanted to of you know stuff I wanted to do and yeah Dark Knight Returns maybe there's a bunch of them um, the other one that I've been thinking about at the time was um, All Star Superman, uh, which is um, one of my favorites. The room opposite to here. Oh, okay, we got the armor already, right? Okay. All right, so really, where we need to go is up. These guys all came back. Oh, these are different from uh, the, the the fake Staphlos where they are last time. All-Star Superman was one I wanted to do. Um, uh, uh, yeah, Fun Home. Because that was right around the time that uh, all those like right-wing people were all really angry about um, Fun Home. So I was like, hell yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Alright, so we've got to go... Oh, okay. oh, yeah, okay, I see it. Yeah, look at the design of those enemies. Bug soldiers. Yeah, because there's... Or maybe, maybe we gotta kill them all. I was also thinking, um... I was gonna do um, one of those uh, those Shakespeare uh, graphic novels. I'd bought a couple of them, and they were pretty cool. I had the um, it was Hamlet, and it's Hamlet and something else. All right, so we can't go there. So it's got to be up. So that means we gotta push something. There we go. Oh, I could use some more of those cherries. At least we know we know where we're going though, so that's good. good
Yeah, that class um, only ran the two times, and then... Yeah, that was it. And right now, we... We can't really run experimental classes like that. Because we did a whole bunch of experimentals around that time. It was a, um, it was a, a detective novel class. There was a, um, i trying to remember what the other ones were. Somebody taught a linguistics class. Key to the crypt. Aha! Okay. I had a couple of ideas for classes. I wanted to do like an um, like a digital humanities class. Yeah, well, women's lit runs every semester. I taught it. Um, when was the last time I taught women's lit? Last year, maybe. Last year, a year before, I taught it. Um, yeah, that, that was a, that was an interesting group, your group. They're good, except for the ones who weren't. Yeah, maybe... Maybe it was last spring? I can't remember. Because I taught... Last spring was... Um, I taught Shakespeare, too. I remember that. I, I, think it, I think it was women's lit. Yeah, that class was huge. Right? Well, I don't think it was so much that. I think it was that we were in that really small room. That was one of those um, those rooms that were um, they were not made for however many. Uh, I'm sure we were at the we were at the the cap, but yeah, I actually went and said something at one point, and the, like there was no place to put us. Um, and because it was um, it was only once a week. It would. I was basically just told, like, you know, I mean, if it's really a problem, we can move it. But otherwise, just you know, try to deal with it. So, all right, fine. Okay, you can't kill this thing. I can get through you. Oh, you're gonna chase me. Okay. Yeah, and then the the 101 you were in, that was a big room. That was that room that was always um it, that was always really cold. I used to hate to, I taught in there a couple couple springs in a row. It was always it was always really, really cold. That's now um they don't do comp in there anymore, uh as far as I know. They do um like video production and stuff like that in there. Cause that's that's a, yeah that's a big room. I remember I forget if it was your class of the year before. There was somebody in that class that used to just come in with like like, a, like all bundled up and like a jacket and because they'd be just so cold. Yeah, it was a couple times I was in there. Alright, 
this is annoying. There we go. Jeez. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah, it was early, right? Right. Yeah, that's a bad time for that class. I have not taught an early morning class in a very long time. All right, we are probably going to die here and yeah, see. I was going to say we are very likely going to die. All right, but now that we know all that, we can go straight to it. Yeah, I haven't taught I haven't taught an eight a.m. since probably like the next year or so after that. Because I used to do that. Um, I used to do the Britlet on Mondays. was where um, a whole bunch of members of the uh, the, the classic uh, Professor Wen crew of that era all met. Kind of. That class actually kind of, that section actually kind of merged like a whole bunch of people from Pemberton and Mount Laurel and then everybody took like a whole ton of classes together. And then meanwhile, at another day that week, I had a bunch of the um, the whole like uh, Delran crew that um, Sam and Justin knew, like Lauren and and, and Megan and Lindsay. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're in there. Um. But yeah, that's 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 the 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 that is the original blend group. Before the second group, which would be like Vinny, Sarah, you know, people like that. Because Sarah had come on her own, she was in a class, and I'd met her in I'd, I'd met her in GameStop. That whole story, but um, she was all by herself. But yeah, no, the the second group, yeah, it's like yeah, Vinny and um. That group. Yeah, Brad. Uh, yeah, Bradley, Ashley. Yeah, yeah. They'd be they'd be part of the second one. That was yeah. That was the second group. Yeah, Bradley was in um. He was in one hundred and one with me. The semester I got hired, um, with him and and this uh, this young lady named Amy who was really cool and yeah, that was a, that was a that was a wild group. They were a bunch of bunch of misfits. It was great. And Amy was in. I'm trying to remember, she was in the one hundred and two with Bradley and Vinny. And, and and Matt and Jackie and that whole group. And then a whole bunch of them ended up in, yeah, the, 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 the Britlets, the, the two Britlets. And then, oh man, these enemies are like brutalizing me here. Here, let's die and try again. Um, 
that then all ended up in like lit and film and stuff like that. And everybody ended up together, finally. And Vinny ended up with us because of his sister, Nicole. And I've had, um, I've had a couple of their cousins too, uh, Nick and Anthony. Whatever, we're just going through this. Actually, no, we should kill these enemies to see if they give us hearts. Because that would be very nice of them. I still talk to Nick a lot. I actually haven't talked to Vinny or Nicole in a while. I talked to Nicole probably like this time last year. I know she's moved a couple times. I know because Vinny's in uh, grad school, I think. And Bradley's in, um, he's in, t uh, Texas now. When he's not on, uh, Saturday Night Live, when he's not guesting on Saturday Night Live with, uh, Saya or whatever her name was. Alright, we just got two cherries in a row, so let's save. That was good. And Ashley's a, I've I've seen Ashley on Instagram. She's around. Yeah, Shakespeare was a good crew with uh, Lauren and and Patty and Lindsay. Um, I see Lindsay. Lindsay goes to my gym like pre-COVID, so I, I used to see her probably like once a week. I'd see her and um. Uh, Patty's around because he was in Florida for a while but I think he's I think he's back now and I haven't talked to Lauren in a while she posts on um, she posts on because uh, she hikes a lot I see on uh, Instagram I used to see Jean from that class uh, when she worked in she worked in Wegmans for a while. Like right after that class, I used to see her, and then she got a, I, she must have got she she was gone, so she must have got a teaching job. Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember her, yeah. yeah she... She might have took another... I forget, she reached out to me at some point about something, and I can't remember what it was. She'd not... I don't think she'd taking classes with me before. 
Yeah, because she wasn't in the... The Britlet. I don't think she was an English major. Oh, well, let's try to blow him up. I see Lindsay from time to time. Um, I talk to Megan once in a while. Because she's in... Um, uh, um, she's in uh, South Korea now. She teaches... Like, um, like English. Which is pretty cool. Oh, I got by it. Nice. All right, we are doing really well right now. And now we're not. It's not how it always goes on streams. Yeah, yeah, I remember her. Oh, can I just go right through? Oh, I can just go right through. Okay. Alright. What's going on with you? Alright, your head's coming off. I don't like that. Okay, what are you doing here? Okay. I feel like this is going way too well. See how it lit up? Oh, you gotta hit the tail. No, 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 no. You gotta hit the. You gotta hit the tail. I get it. Ah. Load. There's a whole ton of people from that era. here no we don't we want to go up was it this one yeah we gotta hit we gotta hit the tail oh yeah didn't that guy the guy in the um 
the guy that's tied up. That was what he said, wasn't it? to get some uh, health here. Ah, oh, come on. I should have saved when um, I got up here last time with all the health. Yeah. Damn it. All right. Well, we'll we'll use this run through. to see how that works. All right, so you gotta hit the tail. Okay. Interesting. Oh, I do, I do have a potion too, okay. This is what happens when you don't play a game for a month. One thing I do not, yeah, that kind of hit detection. I was, I was just about to say. Oh, thank you. Oh, delicious wall cherries. Instead of wall meat. Oh, come on. That thing sucks right there. I had really good health and I just got screwed. Yeah, 
That thing moves quicker than you think. Especially when you only have an analog uh, controller, you're not using a stick. Starts reaching out. Obtain the prized medallion. Triforce piece. So that was level That was level four. So we've got five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we're officially halfway. Very nice. There are two medallions hidden in two crypts somewhere within the rooms of the labyrinths. A sphere of the sea will be saved. You can find the two medallions of our ancestors. The passage to the castle in the sky will then appear. The best way to get to the crypt from here is to go south through the first labyrinth. Okay. So let's go figure out what's all here. Good proper usage of commas there. That green looks so cool. To 
There's a secret stairway in the center of the island. Go to the northeast from here. You must be quite careful to use that stairway. It'll be easy to lose your way. Oh, no. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Toughest of the land's armor is hidden within the chambers of this labyrinth. This armor is essential in your quest to defeat that dastardly demon, Dearth. I never met a piece of armor I didn't like. Find the armor if you wish to survive. Okay. Hey, new viewers. Used to be a wise man named Kareem living near the fountain east of here, but now his house is empty. It was very strange because I don't remember him moving. The old wise man Kareem is responsible for keeping the golden wisdom of our fathers. He lives near the fountain. The fountain is said to be near the castle in the sky. But Kareem is keeping his door locked for fears of Durf's long arms of evil. Eight medallions are the only memory we have of our greatest founding fathers. Dearth was opposed to all they stood for. Brotherhood, purity, honesty, happiness, and love. Okay, so, like two dialogue screens ago, not to get all pedantic, but we properly used commas in a list, and now here, we're not. Ugh. <laughs> he cast them the stone. Can't wait for the three minutes on the podcast episode about this game, about, uh, you know, grammar usage in the translation. Uh, uh, he, he cast up the stone so only evil would influence us. 
The princess is our only hope. She alone has the power to set them free of Durf's eternal spell of stone. <sighs> like so many 1990s RPGs, it's starting to sound like Star Wars. And now we went here, right? We talked to this person. Yeah, okay. Unless you consider happiness and love to be the same thing. Um, you need a comma there. Oh, okay. Oh, check these dudes out. They're cool looking. Yeah, the, the, the colors in this game are beautiful beautiful like look at that purple or maybe that's a pink like that that is so this game is gorgeous it really is yeah the blue's nice too Thank you. Wonderful. is watching everything you do from his eerie castle. I love the way things are described in this game. Eerie castle up on the top of the world. His evil spirit is everywhere. It sends chills down my spine, especially when I'm alone. look like robot Jushin Ligers. Ah yes, his favorite doctor of medicine once again. One dose will cost you 400. I never have this much gold. This is all new, but it'd be nice to kind of know where we are. I 
been trying to go across and and down. Oh, okay, we're back over here. All right. Yeah, at least the the maps in this game, like, they, there's like a sense to them, for sure. They 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 make sense, which is more than I can say for some games. What were we playing that had all the ma oh uh sort of vermilion same era Got little Egyptian liger horns. Is North always up? Rely on your compass to lead you, okay? Sure, man. Yeah, this was the, um, the up from a little ways ago. So we'll go this way. Yeah, I, I prefer having the, having that than the, the flame wall. Because the flame wall only hits them once. It's not like, like in a lot of modern games where it hits it and it hits it, like, like five times it doesn't do that so i'd rather have yeah look the it's like a boomerang it's cool and for purposes of intellectual property different enough from zelda First crypt is to the south of here. Ah, perfect. It's very difficult to find the entrances because the goons have hid them well. Use your compass. The charmed compass is the force of the medallions. I have not used my compass much so far. old man who lived in the sphere. He had the wisdom of 1,000 years. The old man passed the wisdom of our civilization on to a bright scholar named Orion. Dirth was afraid of this man's wisdom, so he took the Orion and changed him in the cellar. It should be a comma before the cell. When you have coordinating conjunction, you need a comma. Actually, at least th this translation is actually, you know, pretty lucid, at least. That's more than you can say about a lot of games in this era. They're just talking... I was catching up on the um, Acts of the Blood God, the Final Fantasy rankings episodes, and that was one of the things they were talking about. That some of those games have, uh, you know... I mean, we got classic lines like, you spoony bard, but... Um, 
fantastic. Stay over there. Yeah, these are moblins, basically. But they're fish. My father, Orion, had the knowledge to gain entrance to the crypt. So Dirth took him away because he was afraid that my father would try to sneak up on him. Okay. Just gonna shiv him. Lust for supreme power must be as dull as his senses. Evil is everywhere now, comma, but maybe he has a weakness. Why else would he be so afraid? Still, I say you hell a cave. Please help. Everyone's information in this game is useful. I mean, we've played some games on stream recently that, like, we played through Castlevania 2. That there's confusion and lies littering that game Entrance to the first labyrinth is above here. However, once Dirt's goons appeared, we had to cover up the entrance. You have to be very clever. <sighs> okay. This isn't it. We have to find Orion. But yeah, we went over here. Do you wish to hear a password now? Yes.
horses leave you. Oh, okay. All right, that's cool. So we went in here. Yeah, this was Orion's kid. All right, I think we gotta go north. I think we have to go north, actually. Because if we go over here, Come on. There we go. <coughs> and if we go back up here, yeah, there's this. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. There's supposed to be a red rock somewhere, according to the guide. And the guide also said, oh, whoops. The guide says that the directions aren't, the directions people are giving aren't really that clear. After I was just saying that all the dialogue is very clear. Oh, make me seem like a liar. the problem, like, it's probably this, but I don't have any bombs. So... nothing gives me a bomb we can't do nothing about it where was that um no it wasn't there where's that person that healed us Oh, what's this? Bombs!
Oh, we only have 100 gold. Why do I only have 100 gold? I thought I had, like... Yeah, wait a minute. I thought I had, like, 600. How'd that happen? Hmm. Huh. Oh, maybe because I died, they might have taken it away. Yeah, they took it away. Right. Go back to the one that has the 400. And we just gotta be careful. And it was over here. And it was up. And then we went over. Yeah, so every time you die, you lose your gold. I had, like, not noticed that at all. Was it here? Where were we? No, this isn't it. Oh yeah, okay, it was over here. Or up? Was it up? Yeah, 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 okay. No, we just we just gotta be careful. save point at least.
Oh, she healed me. But where is she gonna drop me off? Oh, yeah. Okay. Screw that. I puzzle. Can you just wait a minute? Oh. I think that was a no. Me, things coming at me, damn it. You want to eat? you really Oh, now I get... <laughs> now I get...
now I get bombs. Sure. Why not? Oh my god. Come on, go down, go down. Oh, sure, now I get a cherry, too. Jeez. Aha! Okay, we're in. So they're totally not going to put you right back in there, are they? Hmm. I think I can kind of... I think we've wandered around this map enough that I could probably figure it out. Let's try. Yeah, because wasn't it up? No. This looks familiar already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're right here. So yeah, so let's get in there with good with a good amount of hearts. And then we'll do a save. That's better. That's way better. My name is Orion. I'm a bit tied up right now. <laughs> okay. Uh, but perhaps I can help you. Dearth has locked me up because I know the secret of this labyrinth. Listen closely. Push the red stone over there and you'll be on your way to the Crypt of the Medallion. save me from the chains of death. If you could only capture the medallion from inside the crypt, I would be free. Please do all that you can. Or he's not going to tell you again. So that just opens... 
that back up? What does the guide say? Talk to Ori in here and push the red rock. Go south twice and exit the cave. Okay. Oh, oh, jeez! Well, that's an annoying uh, ambush there. Alright. We're officially pulling out the guide. Uh, this is getting confusing. All right, talk to Orion and push the red rock. Go south twice and exit the cave. See, one, one of the things I don't like about this guide is they say things like that, and what they, they just mean two screens. You go south twice. Okay, so one. That was one. Two. Okay. East. Okay. South times two. So one, two, west, and then north. And it's here. Okay. Oh, okay. And then it says, I spent about 20 minutes trying to find this place. One man says Orion is north of here. Yeah, another man says north isn't always north. Yeah, right. Right. Yeah, so Orion was north of here. But the north isn't on. Oh, okay. Well, that's weird for a game that had been pretty clear so far. Wasn't any kind of like... Oh, it's, it's the snakes from Zelda. Okay. They look like, uh... Something other than snakes. This is a fragile hands. Oh, okay, yeah. Alright, so let's try to Yeah, let's try to get back there with um good health. If we can find it again. Game's a blast. It's really awesome.
And that's what I'd been told when I when I'd been telling people that, hey, I think I'm gonna play through Utopia. A bunch of people were like, oh, dude, you're gonna love this game. It's awesome. And even as like a kind of like Zelda clone or whatever, like it does all the things that like modern quote unquote Zelda clones just like really fail to do, which is kind of cool. Stay away from those things. Hug the corners. Oh, ooh, okay. <gasps> All right, that's that's that was weird. Oh, look at those things. They're like they're like little they're like gloops. Did I just make an out-of-date reference? I just absolutely made a very out-of-date reference to the Herculoids. That is a... That was an old reference when I was a kid. Honestly. Never mind. <laughs> right now. And I doubt the Herculoids is on TV all the time like it was when I was a kid. As I always say, syndicated television raised me. Oh, the heater turned on. Okay. They look like shy guys. And the other thing that I, I keep getting told too is that the second Newtopia game is even better than this. So that's interesting. Our hero has acquired the boom bombs. Oh, just gave me more bombs. Okay. Cool. Try to go up. There's uh, some not whiz robes. Actually, that's a cool design, too. Alright, we're gonna die. Crap. Oh, it takes you all the way back here. Okay. That kind of sucks. All right, what do we got? We got 15 minutes. All right, we'll just mess around in here, see what we can find. And we can come back in two weeks. <laughs> no big deal. So this is weird right here. Like, it's hard to get through without getting hit. Alright, so we we gone 
right and seen what was over there. We definitely need to go that way. Yeah, while that, uh, not whiz robe is uh, doing his thing over over there. Let me take these guys out. I just want to play for a couple more minutes and just I just want to see what's. Ah. All right, maybe not. All right, we made uh, some good progress here. We got through another. Um, we got through another labyrinth. We found the next one, and there's a second one here. It looks like, from looking at the guide. So, um, you know, a couple weeks from now, we'll get back in. We'll get back into this, and we'll play some more. Um, you know, good stuff. Oh, a little puzzle went to lay down. Okay, good. Um, yeah, my my back absolutely feels way better after yoga. Definitely. Um, it just needed to get adjusted. Um, yeah, so we'll be back um, on... Uh, what will we play next week? I can't... Oh, yeah! So on Monday, we are going to be playing Scott Pilgrim vs. The World on the Xbox 360, uh, which is being reissued, I think it's actually today, I think it's out, um, it's either today or tomorrow, I think it, I think it was actually, I think on Player One they said it was today. Uh, I have never played Scott Pilgrim vs. The World, but people always tell me that it's like a River City Ransom clone, so I'm... I'm very interested in checking it out, so we'll, um, we'll get that on Monday. And then next Thursday, uh, we'll probably play some Dragon Quest, although last week we kind of, we kind of ran into a little bit of a stumbling point, which is that I need to do some, some, uh, big grinding, so I don't know, maybe we'll, maybe we'll hop back into U Utopia. Or maybe since we're wrapping up Dragon Warrior, maybe we'll start into something else, and then we can come back and wrap up Dragon Warrior. I don't know. Whatever. I got some ideas for what uh, our next RPG uh, Thursday game might be. Um, there's a little list on the overlay, but, you know, that's just me making a list. Um, I think I know what we're going to do next. So... Yeah, Drew, everybody else, we had a big crowd at one point in here. Uh, the number just kept pop going up and up and up, um, which is kind of cool. Um, I know there's definitely an audience for TurboGrafx stuff. I was in somebody else's stream, and they were saying that, you know, not that many people stream TurboGrafx games, so, you know, um, yeah, it's not like you're the 8 billionth person streaming FIFA or whatever. So, um, cool. All right, we will return on Monday. Everybody have a good weekend. I got a lot to do this weekend. And um, I got to do some redesign on my home office uh, this weekend. I just got some new uh, shelving stuff. So I'll be doing that and some other things. And um, okay, everybody, stay safe and talk soon.